I believe that after working and serving this industry uh, for the past 20 years, uh, it's an honor to be called to be one of the judges of the World Spa and Wellness Awards. Uh, it's a responsibility I take very seriously. Uh, I enjoy it, of course, it's very rewarding. Um, but really, uh, I, I feel through my experience, it's, um, it's the most thorough and independent judging uh, uh, panel association awards affiliation uh, in the industry. I love seeing what's happening in our industry. It's a really great way to keep my finger on the pulse. Um, I love the process of going through and evaluating all the businesses, giving it a great audit um, and seeing, you know, what different brands are out there every year. I am very intrigued and honored to be involved and be able to judge and identify other property. Participating in the awards, even if you don't win, motivates your team to, to do utmost, to demonstrate their perfect skills. Are the most thorough, rigorous um, process of evaluation and recognition of innovation, international best practices, and leadership. I think that the awards is a wonderful tool to surpass ourselves and to reevaluate ourselves to be more competitive. You're, you're getting a lot of value by a group of professionals who are really evaluating your concepts, they're evaluating your operations, your tools, your marketing. So you're getting, as a director, you're getting quite a bit of feedback, which is, um, it's a fantastic opportunity for you. Plus in instances where we can actually visit the properties, um, we get to really experience that. And I think with such a, an incredible network of um, experts within the wellness industry, um, having your, your um, strategy validated by that group of people is priceless. It gives your staff such a boost. So especially during the times that we've been through in the last few years, having that award um, highlights what you're doing, what you're doing right, first of all. But I think most importantly, it highlights what great job the team is doing and why they can use that going forward. So it has lots of opportunities within. It's not just about we want a nice award, we'll put it on the mantle. It's really about being able to, to strive to be at the next level. To win an award in an event like this is actually very prestigious. Uh, the world knows um, this company, the world knows this event. Uh, it's so, I mean, to come out on top of something like this is, is global and it's a high recognition. It's very important that people are honest I know from experience, we tend to put everything and anything down when we are entering, but um, I think it's very important to say who you are, what you offer, what you do, what you've achieved. We want to see how venues go over and beyond and try to outcompete themselves year after year. But I really want to identify what businesses value proposition are, what makes them different, what makes them stand out, um, and why your specific strategy or concept or programming stands out amongst the industry. Well, what a year to play a role, because I think there's gonna be a lot of um, game changers, new experiences, new concepts, um, and really possibly emergence of a shift that we see holistically once all the, all the entries come through. And um, I, I think it would be great to see who's leading the way. But also quite exciting is that there's new categories as well, right? of course, um, for independent operators, for individuals and for brands to showcase their excellence also. I hope that new nominees, new participants will demonstrate really innovative ideas that we are so hungry for in our industry.